Welcome to VM Blog's coverage of IGEL Now and Next, taking place in Miami, Florida at the Fountain Blue. Today I have the pleasure of having Jim Luna uh, with me from Nutanix. How are you doing today? Hey, doing great. Uh, good to be once again here in uh, Miami, you know, for another year at uh, IGEL Now and Next. Seems like we were just year. here, right? I know, right? Uh, so this is the next part, I think, of, from last year, right? Right. Uh, great location, you know, good people. A lot of good sessions, good to be here. Um, tell me a little bit about Nutanix. Yeah, you know, Nutanix provides a software platform that allows companies to remove a lot of complexities in IT, right? Especially across uh, apps, whether it's mission critical apps, whether it's data apps, whether it's uh, web apps, um, as well as in areas like containers, right? Uh, AI. Uh, and of course, EUC and, and VDI. So the, the whole premise of Nutanix is to really make simplicity uh, the, the central goal of, uh, of uh, managing IT and supporting IT. So removing complexity and making things simple, scalable, and performant. So what are the, some of the big problems that uh, Nutanix solves for the customers? You know, we offer a range of solutions, right? You know, one of the things we're, we're doing right now is providing hybrid multi-cloud solutions. Customers at many times want to deploy workloads on-prem, but they also have a need to deploy work, workloads in the cloud. And so Nutanix provides a licensed software that allows customers to be able to manage those workloads both on on-premises, whether it's a choice of hardware like HPE or Lenovo or Cisco and so forth, but also in hyperscaler clouds like Azure and EUC. All that is done through one software platform highly portable, same license, right, and full mobility. And that's a very unique offering that, that Nutanix does. But there's other things as well, right? Nutanix provides a Kubernetes platform with um, uh, Nutanix Kubernetes. Uh, it also pro provides uh, Nutanix Unified uh, Storage, which we call NUS. Uh, and most recently, we provide a platform for AI, Nutanix Artificial Intelligence as well, among other things. Of course, within all that, we have the solution for EUC and VDI. We provide high, highly performant uh, systems to be able to deploy, run, manage, and support highly scalable uh, VDI environments. And since we're here at IGEL, um, maybe you can tell me a little bit more about your partnership with IGEL? Yeah, absolutely. You know, Nutanix and IGEL are in adjacent uh, in technologies, but really playing in the same sandbox within the, the whole construct of uh, virtual desktops, VDI, EUC, virtual client computing. On the one hand, Nutanix provides the, the bottom layer infrastructure to be able to deploy VDI environments, right? So, so the software and the infrastructure below that. Uh, and and uh, IGEL provides the infrastructure to, to deploy it at the client base, right? And, and what's really unique is we support a variety of VDI brokers, whether it's uh, Citrus, whether it's Omnisa, whether it's Parallels or Workspot or Frame, right? And at the same time, IGEL does the same thing, right? It really provides choice and flexibility across a number of different platforms as well. So what we have in common is that we play in the same environment, uh, but we really offer choice, flexibility, right, the performance, uh, at the same time harden those platforms to provide security for end customers as well. Now, you mentioned uh, AI, and it's been a hot topic for everybody. Yeah. You know, everybody's trying to figure out how to incorporate it or uh, you know, protect themselves against AI. Um, what are some of the things that Nutanix is doing with AI? Yeah, you know, it's, it's a field that's crowded today, but uh, everybody's having a little bit of a say in it, right? And Nutanix started on this, you know, a couple years ago in terms of providing a product called GPT in a box, right? And now that's been renamed to NAI. And essentially what Nutanix is doing for uh, enterprises is to be able to uh, take an environment where the customer needs to protect that data and run the inferencing within the firewall, right? Um, you know, companies will run a lot of the large language models in other infrastructures, but in terms of protecting the data and doing the referencing, Nutanix is offering what we call NAI, and that's the base layer for customers to be able to protect their data, manage their data, and ensure they're getting a highly reliable uh, and performant uh, platform to be able to begin to invest and harness the benefits of, of AI. Uh, you know, so that's from a product perspective, and of course, uh, from, from a use perspective, Nutanix is beginning to um, explore and implement various uh, solutions and tools, right, in terms of how do we harness the goodness of AI for everyday work, right? Um, and so that's another protection as well that's happening. Well, before I let you go, um, 
maybe you can tell us what's the best way for people that can't be here at the show. I mean, obviously, this is a, a great opportunity. If you come to iGel now next to network with all these EUC companies, and uh, but you know, let's face it, not everybody has a opportunity to come here. Yeah. Um, What's the best way for them to learn more about Nutanix? Yeah, no, absolutely. Look, uh, Nutanix is here at the show once again, right? Uh, we were recently also at HIMSS, and we did that together with IGEL. Um, and of course, we have you know our conference dot next coming up as well here in the next month as well. And IGEL, we are we participating there as well. Um, you know, the best way to reach us out is through Nutanix.com. We have uh, services there; they can look through that offering. Uh, we have a page that's dedicated to IGEL as well. If you go to Nutanix.com forward slash IGEL, get onto our slash page about IGEL as well. Uh, and there's a number of different sources of solutions, and in particular there's an EUC page uh, that talks about the services that Nutanix offers uh, in terms of EUC, VDI as well. Um, and then there's also a way to try it. There's a trial resource you can do, a test, test drive if you, if you will, right? Customers can really do a test drive, as well as use uh, TCO calculators to determine how to best uh, leverage their uh, assets to deploy UC VDI most effectively. So we look forward to uh, connecting with more uh, partners and customers um, as we uh, continue forth in, uh, in, in this industry. Well, I wish you uh, success with your upcoming shows and uh, it was a pleasure speaking with you as always. Great, great seeing you once again. Thank you.